You probably want to go stand in the choir stand. If you want to take pictures, you come up this way. Come round here, baby. Yeah. Obedience to the great head of the church. And now we come to baptize one and say they will leave. That Jesus will save her in the dying hour. But based upon her confession, we now baptize her in the name of the Father, the name of the Son, and the name of the Holy Ghost. Even that God will save them in a dying hour. And therefore, based upon the profession of their own faith, come to baptize them in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost. Now, I got you. Ready? All right. Hold down. Hold down. Hold down. Hold down. Hold down. Hold to the room they found just like Jesus said it would be. And therefore then Jesus came back and prepared the upper room for them. When Jesus came back, he just robed himself and began to wash their feet. He talked to them and he said, three days, the temple is going to be rebuilt. But he said, likewise, also one of you shall betray me. And then they looked among themselves the and asked the universe for the Lord. Okay. Is it I? Mm -hmm. Individually and collectively, mm -hmm. Lord, is it I? And then not only that, he said, but the Bible oh, offers a remnant. All you gotta do is pray and pray for you. And the Lord will forgive you for each and every sin you have committed, except one. Blasphemy doesn't always forgive you. And then Paul got it. He said, Many among you are sick and sleep. Why? Because you're taking undertaking unworthily and called damnation to yourself. But the Bible also gives you another record. So let a man examine himself. And we say to you, not only examine yourself, but pray your prayer of forgiveness. And God will forgive you for each and every sin. And therefore, Jesus said, It's better that that man had never been born. Likewise, then he took the bread and he broke it. This is my precious body, which I died for you out of Catholic law. Likewise, he took the cup and he blessed it. He said, This is my blood of the New Testament. I will not drink it anew with you again until I come unto my Father's kingdom. Father God, we come again and say thank you for your grace, for your mercy. Thank you for your daughter and son, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Long bleeding, died in Catholic mm -hmm. Father God, we truly thank you for these new converts. Yes, sir. Father God, we ask you to strengthen them in knowledge and wisdom. Father God, we ask you to give them a close walk with your darling son, Jesus. Yeah. Father God, we ask right now that you allow them to have the right knowledge and the right mind to be faithful to your darling son, Jesus. Father God, we ask you to bless them. Bless their families. Father God, we ask you to keep them in your gift protection. We ask you to bless this uh, bread and this wine, Father God. And we ask right now that you allow us to continue to grow in your word. Jesus, another blessing we pray to your darling son, Jesus. Deacons and deaconess and the 
preachers all to uh, give them the right hand of fellowship. What a fellowship, what a joy divine. of the Holy Ghost on the first day of August 2019 here at Zion Hill Baptist Church with Pastor White and Pastor Cook. And so therefore, these certificates are yours to give and keep with your record to give them to your parents. Okay. The real estate, the real estate, is that right? The real estate, not right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Brother Dakota Duggan and Jordan Taylor. All right. Let's give my hands raised. <laughs> 